Boxing King Media, it's all right, Boxing King Media in association with boxer Terry Harper. Um, deja vu, we're back again, another fight week, uh, uh, seven days later. Yes, uh, I should probably be uh, at home relaxing right now, but here I am and uh, do you know what, a massive thank you to Eddie and Matt Shroom and, and my opponent obviously making it possible to be such a quick turnaround and getting me out the week later, so not as, it's not as bad. What were you supposed to be doing this week? You know, should you have fought last Saturday? Well, uh, you luckily we usually book an holiday straight after, but that's in a few weeks, and we should be at family wedding this Saturday. So I'm going to be missing that, uh, unfortunately. But you know, it's like I said, I'm just grateful to be back out, and everything happens for a reason. And I love Manchester. I've boxed here a couple of times, and I enjoy being on a Leewood card. And uh, I feel like it's my lucky charm, so I'm excited. And just tell us, at uh, the moment Steffi knocked on your door, just talk to talk us through how, how it was broken to you last week. No, we were actually at the 5K, and um, uh, I saw I saw Eddie pull Andrew over after the after the run, and I looked at Andrew and I saw his face drop, and I thought it's fucking it's bad news, and uh, so I know, like he, he called me over and just like she's pulled out ill, and uh, I knew I, I was like, are you joking? But I thought I can't be joking because it's a bit of a shit joke, really, isn't it? So. Um, I was good to be fair, uh, we, I was supposed to come home Monday um, but we just got the flight, early flight home Sunday to get, to get back in the gym, uh, back sparring, I had a couple of rounds just to sharpen up because we didn't want to leave it too long, tapering as well and um, yeah I, cri I cried all day Sunday feeling sorry for myself but uh, once I got the sparring and everything out of the way just back into fight mode and I feel like I've got a bit more like fire in my belly this week, whereas last week I was probably a bit relaxed and uh, this week I'm ready to just get in the ring and just fight, have a good scrap. Any risk of that affecting you uh, Saturday? No, not all. Uh, luckily, I'm a, obviously I'm a much higher weight um, and I know if I was still making the 130, uh, 134? 130? I don't know. <laughs> 134. If I was still making that weight, there's no way I would have been able to fight this week. It's just impossible. But like I said, everything happens for a reason. And uh, I'm fit and healthy. And I, I feel like I'm more sharp this week, to be fair, and more, more ready for a fight. And obviously, you've got a week to prepare for a completely different opponent. Uh, obviously, do you know much about her? Is she similar to what you were fighting before? Uh, no, she's completely different to Cecilia. And uh, seeing that she shared the ring with Clarissa and stuff, uh, we've, had, we've had a good sit down and watch uh, Sunday when we're back in the gym. And... Uh, do you know what it is what it is, it's boxing, it's the game and you just got to get in, get in the ring and do what you do best really, just focus on myself and know my capabilities and know what I can do and uh, I'm just grateful that I've got an opponent. Yeah, and looking at a record, she only loses to good fighters, so if you win Saturday, you join that list yeah. of Clarissa Shields and, and Cecilia. Yeah, we, that's another thing, we stripped everything back, looked at her record uh, and seen that every time she's had a step up, she's, uh, she's been defeated, so uh, just needs to get the job done Saturday. Any last words, Terry? Just, I want to fight. <laughs> Teddy means business. All the best, Terry, and hopefully it goes well.